All right, folks, here we go again. Recipe number three, you're not gonna believe this. Steak and fries. Roto Q360, let's see what we can do. Old Murph, you know the Old Murph recipe. Take this steak, great cut of meat. Take a look at that, slap that baby down. Real simple, real simple. We're doing pepper. Get that in there, get that in there. We're doing salt. Woo, not much. Write this down if you can't figure this out. And my favorite, a little Mrs. Dash. There we go. Real simple, both sides. I figure out as I go, but I have a little or a lot of help with the Roto Q360. So we're just gonna slap this baby in right here. Secure that. We're gonna take our French fries. Make a generous, generous display on the bottom of our tray here. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. This guy must be mad. How can you cook steak and fries at the same time? You know how I can? With the Roto Q360. Here we go. Simple as always. Crank this baby up. Pull the trigger. And in the oven we go. All right, it's been about 20 minutes. Our steak should be ready. Let's see how the Roto Q360 did. Can you believe this? Can you believe this? Good golly, Miss Molly. Look at that. Pita Luga. Eat your heart out. Good girl. As always, we hit our little trigger. We give it a spin. Let's pop this bad boy open. Simple, simple, simple. Yeah, look at our fries too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Your mouth isn't watering. Ooh, it's gonna be. Look at that. Look at the juice. Look at the color. Let's see a little incision here. For all you meat lovers out there. For all you meat lovers out there. Take a look at that. Would you? Don't thank me. I just prepared. Thank the Roto Q360. Bon appetit. <laughs> yeah, somebody. It cuts easy too. Yeah. What's up? James is James is Yo, cut another piece for uh, please. How's that? Yeah. Yo, you gotta do one, bro. There it is. No fat. Just lean meat. High quality. Roto Q3. Look at them coming around. They didn't get enough of it. Let's do it. 